in Birmingham, Alabama right now in a place called The Basement. Here at The Basement, we are not perfect. We are just. We are just. We are just. We are just forgiven. Welcome to Birmingham, Alabama and what God is doing at The Basement. You need to wake your mom up and tell her it's time. It's G-O-D. It's about five. Put your bombs in there. Let's go. I'm about five seconds away from giving you the most amazing experience. Hey. I'm going to give you five. I'm going to give you four. I'm going to give you three. I'm going to give you two. Come on. I'm about Every promise is true. Everything he wrote is secured. God is everything we've ever looked for. He's the only one who has the power to forgive. He's the only one who has the power to save. He's made it very clear that he would have it that none should perish. That every one of us would go to eternity and spend it with him. And what I love about God is he makes it so incredibly awesome. He's never, I've never said that it's easy, but it is awesome. Because once you catch a hold of his promise, you want everybody else to know about it. The Bible says all of heaven rejoices if one comes to his name. And I'm reminded of so many people that live their life as if either Jesus is coming back or they're going to him. They live their life as if eternity counts. And I stand amongst so many people that are going to be heroes of the faith. You're going to be recorded as they say in Hebrews now that they cheer us on. Because we stand and we live for him. You know, all it takes sometimes, sometimes your life is the only Bible some will ever read. But man, if you ever get bold enough to let somebody else know, you never know who you might be telling. Just one person could affect so many people. Man, God is always up to something. And I'm reminded of being in a basement. Just a basement, an original old nasty basement was actually my room and I was there and tonight is the reunion and sometimes we celebrate what God has done and I remember being with some of these guys, these were the few that I found first and I remember right after I, I accepted Christ I was so excited I just wanted to tell one person and I never knew that if you told one person that they would tell another person and then many might be saved because of telling that one person. Wicked, wicked.